Is anyone in voice? Uh, okay. Yeah, you're running a deep but not a Zarya, so. It's gonna be kinda awkward for you. You just kinda have to play around with your DPS to get picks. And going after that. First though. Been. We should always uh, fire strike the door. So for this point particularly, you can, you can come around here through the choke around left side, um, and you can see their spawn room um, through this mega room here. And you can throw your fire strike at whatever, like one or two seconds left, um, and you can get some ult charge right off the bat. Um, and then you'll have plenty of time to get back before they actually push. So always do that. Is that an hard. Get the fire strike on the uh, on the front door. Okay. Anyway, playing in the league. Yeah, I kind of gave up on that game. I didn't have a Bastion back up. Um, so you say they have a Bastion back up, but you don't really back up. Um, you kind of back up, but your whole team stays here. Um, to fight him. And instead of like going back behind here, um, we just stay in this kind of really awkward area where they can like still walk through choke and get the space they want and Bastion can shoot us for free, which is like double bad, right? So, so the play here um, is to either play this choke or to back up, but we can't do, you know, neither one and just sort of uh, sit here, like in the awkward in between space. And we're not shielding the Bastion either, right? If we're standing here in this awkward in between space. Like he could shoot our team for free, which is not good for us, of course. So if we wanted to call to go back, right, we could have stayed where we were, shielded here, said back, back, back and held our S key, right? So like we're shielding team, they see us visibly moving backwards. Um, and we call it a few times to let them know, we the shield are not going to stay here and fight a Bastion that can free shoot us. We're gonna play somewhere else. And this isn't really your fault. We're going to review um, you playing Reinhardt because you're on Reinhardt. But um, it's one of the reasons he's really not a great hero right now. Um, he's very good in GOATS. But outside of GOATS, he's not really that good. Um, Ariza's typically better than him um, if you're not running GOATS. And as you can see, like part of the reason why, like you're basically just a standing shield. Like You can't really do anything at all against the pharmacy. Um, you can't really do much against Bastion um, because he obviously shreds your shield. You have to get literally up next to him. Um, 
and you don't really have the burst damage in your comp to deal with him, which by um, association means that their Reinhardt gets advantage on you because he has a Bastion and you don't, right? So you're just kind of screwed by their entire comp, and you can't really contribute here just because it's Rhine. <laughs> But our diva's gonna be. I uh, diva don't. Oh no. Oh. Okay. Gonna yeah, talk about this too. Yeah. So you had ample amount of time there to um to hear the uh the bomb. This is really dangerous. Luckily, it doesn't get anybody, um, which is really good for us. But when Diva Bomb goes off, you pretty much have to be a right click bot. Because um, it's just, it's too iffy. There are too many things that can go wrong, right? Make sure we block the Diva Bomb. Charge. But now, like, even regardless, right? Like, just charging in general is bad. Um, it's worse because um, because of the diva bomb. But like, how to do this? So let's say that this is that's kind of scuffed. Let's say that this is the uh, the team fight, right? Here's uh your team. You're the X's. Here's their team. They're the O's. So if you charge this Reinhardt into their team and end up behind them, oh, didn't turn out the way I expected. Close enough. Okay. So if you charge this Reinhardt, you end up behind them. None of your teammates can help you. <laughs> um, which is very bad. And pretty much the entire enemy team can shoot you. Which is also bad. Um, oh no, next. <laughs> um... <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> this is basically going to lead to your death uh, pretty much every time. So, the times to actually use charge. So, leaving spawn to get back faster and use charge then. Two, when the enemy Ryan charges you. So counter charging. Outside of this, um, you should almost never charge outside of this. Almost never. Okay, we're back. Paul, I actually don't know what happened there. I have shatter, I'm gonna get this one. Oh, you actually got it. Nice! Phew! He missed one. That's the bomb. Winnable. Nice. Beautiful flat team cup. Yeah, it's a little bit questionable. It's a little bit questionable. Is that super? Hey man. The big shatter. It's only the Rhine? 
but like it's really big actually in that situation. You can actually hold high ground here, by the way. You can go up here. That way, you can retreat easier. Instead of, like, having to, like, walk through this way, you can just walk and fall down. And you can provide cover for your snipers so your Widow can shoot for free and do more good stuff like this. His shot. He should have. He's waiting for it. Really unfortunate. Did you call it? Yeah. Always make sure to tell your team when your shield's low. Um. It's. I know it has this really, really obvious visual cracks through it, but your team's not always paying attention. So always say it. Just get into the habit of that, um, of letting them know when uh, when your shield's low. Also, if you know that the other that the enemy Ryan has shatter, and that your shield's like one HP, one of the things you can do is just shatter the rest of his team. Like you could get this Lucio here. Um, and then they're, they're going to divert their attention to, like, what that what's going on over there, instead of him, like, just shattering you for free. Go for Kefrikman's again. Yeah, no, do not be Kefrikman. That is not good. Maybe still no, no. this one, too. Uh, Wait, he might have got that guy. He turned. Did you get it? I think you get the baby diva. Okay, what else? I think you got her though. You went for the uh, the seven ten bolt right, split back. there. Can never trust Shatter to be reliable. Friends are complaining about Brig. <laughs> um, you have an Anna and a Baptiste, so you have tons of healing here. Um, what your Diva's doing is not really good. It's not what Diva should be doing, but I, I, hey, it's what she's chosen to do. Vera Ryan is dead right now. So if you play up here, you can get a lot of value, actually. Um, you don't want to LOS your supports by going around this corner, but you can hold this corner, for sure. They can pocket you through a Koa. Koa only does 70 damage a second, I believe. Anna heals 75-ish. I think it's like one point. Or it might be like 0.8 seconds. I don't know. Um, it's somewhere around there. It's somewhere around, like, 
70 to 75-ish healing per second from Anna. And since you have decent shield health, considering they're Ryan's dead, um, you can play up here and you're fine. You also have, like, all your health, so... So you'd be okay to play up here. And you have a bat fill, too. But, like... You can't really get any value here as Reinhardt when you're like literally playing next to your supports. That's not going to create any space for your team. And now, see, their Reinhardt is dead right now. Their Reinhardt's dead, and they're walking in on you guys. If we just played up here, they wouldn't be able to do that. Um... Oh, you guys are just talking about weak. There's a soldier flanking you with by the way. Uh, let's get the two of them in this room. Good nice. call. I'm wearing. Nice. So they're still gonna have their visor. They're gonna have their beat again. Fire strike in uh, one second, which does a hundred and fifty damage when you're nano. Just a, a lot. Um, and if you crouch, um, if you crouch when you uh, when you fire strike, then it'll like ride along the floor, and you can hit multiple people with it. Uh, but if you stand up, it'll go down at, like, a weird 45-degree angle. Um, and it'll, like, blow up on the ground. Oh, thank you for the follow, by the way. I appreciate it, Ninja. Um, so, it'll, like, go down, and, and it won't, like, work the right way. But if you, like, crouch as Reinhardt, that's just going to be a terrible drawing. I won't even bother doing it. You can uh, shoot it along so it, like, goes indefinitely until it hits a wall. Just really pog. Is there a way for you to download the stream? Um, I don't know. Can you? Can you download Twitch streams from other people? I know you can download your own Twitch streams. I can upload it to YouTube if you want. So it's fine to fight him, like, right here. Um, but once you get around this corner, your team just can't help you anymore. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'll upload it to you, too. In the next coming days. Madman fights Reaper's Ryan. You know what? Sometimes you gotta do it, here it
The good thing is they were just getting out of spawns. They couldn't really push yet. Kind of lost both phase for it. He should have Shatter again. He's looking for it. Oh! That's unfortunate. I, would, I probably would have done it too. That was actually a really good thing. Oh, unfortunately. Go back through the field uh, in the middle of the point. Instead of the corner. You guys should still hold. Oh no. Still hold. Lost like three, right? It's OT respawns. Yeah, the bat's a little bit questionable with the uh with the fields. But. <laughs> He's playing for himself. They've gotten plenty of picks in their defense. Everyone always gets mad at the DPS. That's like the the classic thing. Like plat thing is just to yell at the DPS if things like don't go well. Ah, yes, Diva goes McCree. To make your job that much harder. So, again, this is a Reinhardt bot, so we're gonna, like, review uh, Reinhardt, but this comp's even worse than the last one to play Ryan with. Um, typically, if you're going triple or quad... DPS comps, you're going to want to play ball, or if you can't play ball, Winston can work-ish, too. Um, Ryan's just really bad, um, because Ryan just likes to slowly press W, like that's his thing, um, which your DPS don't really want to do. Doom wants to get in and get out, Widow wants to sit there forever and eventually hit something. Um, and then McCree, who's helpful in like protecting your back line, isn't really needed because Mercy can heart pocket Anna. Um, and Mercy herself is safe because she has a widow she can fly to um, if she gets into trouble. Um, so the comp doesn't make a lot of sense, but yeah, he picked up a reason in Hammond because of, yeah, yeah, definitely. 
Um, oh, and they have fast. I do like that you're just farming shatter. You're not just like pressing shift into the bash. Yeah, attacker Riza would be better here. Attacker Riza's not really as bad as you try and make it out to me. Let's play this out and then I'm gonna try to shatter. And if I can get Bastion. Nice. Love the plans. Oh boy, yeah, you're dead. Oh, you got out. Nice. Hey Rum, what's up? Destroy your turret. Nice! Shield a turret. They're all down. That is a massive shatter. I like it. Get baby diva. Alpha. And Moira is in there with her too. He's got back to work. So you got. You have a job. Oh, you have a job! Hog yeah, wrong. The You're doing the thing. She get a jump off. That's actually so huge for you guys. Follow Diva. Don't let her get away. Nice. That's massive. Alright, push, push, push. We have 10 seconds. My ultimate is ready. Let's go. So, um, I will say this. Uh, the way Ryan works, let's do a... Dude, these drawings get more and more scuffed by the day. The way Ryan Hart works is what he wants to do is go from wall to wall or cover to cover with his shield. That's what his shield's for. So if you start here, right, you'll say get shield, shield, shield to get to this wall. Then wait, recharge it, get to this wall, shield, shield, shield in between. Get here, wait, recharge, shield, 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 shield. Get behind this wall, wait, recharge. If we're saying like, uh, for instance, the bastions on this up here. I know that this isn't an actual map. This is the kind of uh, theory behind how Ryan works. Um, and it's not just for Bastion comps, too. That's just the way Ryan works in general. Um, he wants to get to walls and cover as quickly as he can, so you can play around those, right? Because you, you can peek and fire strike off of them. You can left-click as much as you want if somebody's like right on the other side of the wall, and then you can back away. And you can hold shield walk forward so your team can get space. Um, let's be some guys. That face down. Oh! Get away with it. Let's see. Like, even though we got away with this, because we did this, Bastion literally got to shoot our team for free. So this is why we say, like, no charge. Um, if we want to close distance, right, we can close here, and then we can close to here, or we could close to here, and then you go around, right? You obviously don't want to go around, because you got the, the D.Va pick early. Um, so we go from this first choke here, to this middle place, shield our team to here, wait behind this pillar for a little bit, for our shield to recharge, and then we move up here to this right side. 
instead of being like, I'm here, awkward, a lot of open ground, I'll just press shift to try and get there. Yeah, Rom, go ahead and send me. Send me, uh. Alright, let's regroup. Send me a bot. <laughs> we have, uh, one more before this. We have the. A support player bot. Get yours. Unfortunately. You can shield the rest, bro. Hmm. Can't believe Mercy got away with it. Alright, let's wait that out. Oh, I got the way down. Big. Alright. Let's push that. Come around with me. Playing this wall really well. Thank you. Every shatter has been like insanely bad. Oh, you did the thing! No, you did the thing. You still, I think you still cap. You see how like every time you get in trouble, like, like. Like charge is not done good things for you. <laughs> um, and it's like that for everybody. It's not a good ability. It's literally the worst ability in the entire game. Um, it's there to make you think that you can do stuff that you actually can't. And to debate you into making mistakes. Just don't press it. Um, I think you would have probably killed literally everybody by this holy fuck game. You got the man on. Like, if you just keep swinging, they're all gonna die, and you'll live. Which means that if they respawn, you can still show it to your brain. Please get it, please get it, guys. I believe. Like, imagine if that was a better Diva Bomb, and like, it would've killed like three or four people. That could've been bad. Get over here. Yeah, trading is really bad at attacking to CPB. Because of the response, obviously. He did assert dominance, though. You are correct. And that's what matters. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention, we have extra commands now. Added a bunch of commands. Just Mostly the basic done. stuff. The positivity PMA run. I like it. <laughs> Okay, they wasted their mortality. It's the, the 
bandit command is easily the best command. Down. Do they have do they have a crash? They don't have a crash. They have a torp in this room. Um, I guess we can try to go at the torp. Nice. Two down, push. Push with me. You're actually vulnerable to getting countercharged here, which is one of the other reasons you shouldn't use charge. So that, like, if you use it and it doesn't, like, it goes awry somehow, you can get countercharged. Um, like, he could actually just countercharge you, and it would be like a two foot pin. Which those ones aren't bad. Like, if you're only gonna go like two or three feet, those charges are less bad than the other ones. Um, but he could actually get you here um, if he pressed you. Too lazy to like, uh, like edit anymore. Those things were kind of long sometimes. Anyway, all in all, um, solid Ryan play actually. Legitimately massive shatters the entire game. Um, just number one. I feel like this is always the thing I say. I just want one Ryan VOD where I don't say this. Or like, this doesn't even come up. No shift. Just don't press it. It's it's the number one way to accidentally throw as Reinhardt. There are just so many things that can go wrong. Um, it's literally the worst ability in the game. Um, so yeah. Yeah, just look. I've actually told people to unbind shift before a year ago. No joke. And it has helped them. People have actually climbed after they've done that. No joke. No shift. Um, we only use shift A. Coming out of spawn. Man, I can't spell. Coming out of spawn. B. Or 2. Counter charge. That's it. We shouldn't shift other than that. Until we're really, really, really insanely good at the game. No charge. Um, what else? Just be cognizant of, like, how to take space as Ryan, like, positive space um, is Reinhardt. You basically just use your shield kind of in the in-betweens. Like, you want to be swinging as much as possible, actually, um, as Reinhardt. You want to use your left click as much as you possibly can. Um, so you want to keep going from corner to corner until you get in the enemy's face and you can swing on them. Um, shift in the goat trap. Yeah, okay. That that too. If you happen to be like playing uh, goats, and the enemy team trinks your graph, then yes, shifting can be good. Short charges though. Short charges. <laughs> 